Today is the day the lioness returns to the pride with her cubs. They have been on a long and tough journey. Early in the morning, the lioness took her cubs and set off. The cute little cubs had to run to keep up with their mother. After a year away, the lioness successfully added three healthy cubs to the pride. At one point, one of the cubs stopped, thirsty and in desperate need of water. But when it saw its mother getting further away, it quickly picked up its pace to catch up. The journey was long, and the lioness remained vigilant to ensure the safety of her cubs. She kept them within her line of sight and constantly watched her surroundings. She had raised them for a whole year, so today she couldn't afford any mistakes. The lioness was thirsty herself, but fortunately there was a water source up ahead. The little ones picked up their pace. The lioness bent down and gulped down water, then got up to continue the journey. Meanwhile, the three little ones kept drinking eagerly. When they noticed their mother had moved on, the cubs rushed to catch up. However, it seemed one was missing. There it is. Run, run, or you'll be left behind. Although tired, the lioness didn't stop for a rest because only by returning to the pride quickly could she ensure her cubs' safety. Spending extra time on the road meant more danger. The little ones were resilient and didn't fall behind. As the saying goes, the child who cries gets candy. So the smallest cub got carried in its mother's mouth, while the other two didn't receive such treatment. That must have been quite the comfy ride. When the lioness is about to give birth, she stays away from the pride. After giving birth, she raises her cubs alone, needing to hunt and protect them. It's a tough job, which is why the survival rate of lion cubs is not very high. The cubs don't return to the pride until they turn one year old. Luckily, the journey was uneventful. They were getting closer to the pride, needing only to cross the river to reach the pride's territory. Once they made it past the river, the lioness could finally relax. She carried the cubs across the river, followed closely by the other two, bravely following their mother across the water. Finally, they were safely back home and the cubs would soon get to meet their father.